And we have an all-women panel today, Aprajita Sarangi, Member of Parliament of the BJP, Dr. Ami Ben Yagnik, Member of Parliament of the Congress, Dr. Maua Maji is the Member of Parliament of JMM, Sushmita Dev, Member of Parliament of the TMC. Dr. Ami Ben Yagnik, <coughs> is this a case of missed opportunity? Could 2022 have been 1977 when Neelam Sanjeeva Reddy was elected and opposed? On 75th year of India's independence, when the country was getting its first tribal president and a woman too, could all political parties have come together and ensured that she goes to Raisina Hill unopposed? Maria, today, first of all, uh, instead of getting into all this, I would like to give my heartiest congratulations to Draupadi Murmuji. She is uh, uh, the first tribal woman to be the uh, president, 15th president of our country. And I think uh, I have so much hope that uh, she is an embodiment of women empowerment. And uh, she would, apart from preserving, protecting and defending the constitution, will also look at the twin object. One is that uh, women empowerment and which is very, very, very much needed, uh, though we are in the third uh, decade of the 21st century. And secondly, all the forest rights and the tribal rights, which are really needed to be boosted by the acts that are in place, but not implemented. And that is what I think is very important today, rather than talking about what would have been and why should it have Fine been enough. and why it has Fine not happened. Fine enough, ma'am. Uh, I really appreciate you taking that line. Sushmita Dev, uh, Mamata Banerjee has always positioned herself as the champion of women, women's rights. She often says that she is a woman leader, woman chief minister. Again, this was a case of second woman uh, president, but the first tribal woman president of India. Uh, would you have wanted to vote for her? See, Mamta Banerjee, Chief Minister of Bengal, made it very clear that she was not voting against an individual. It was a fight of ideology. She made it very clear that the opposition was on one side and they had a joint meeting, as you know, all the op 17 opposition parties came to a conclusion. This was not a fight against Draupadi ji. This was a fight against the ideology and let me tell you, Draupadi Murmuji winning to make it into a BJP's victory is completely the wrong narrative. This was a fight, a democratic fight. And in a democracy, you can contest any position, whether it's presidents, whether it's vice presidents, whether it's a member of parliament or an MLA. So to make it about a certain community, about a certain gender and a certain caste is absolutely wrong. This is a larger fight about protecting the constitution this is the highest post. This is the highest post and supposed to be the protector of the constitution. And what Mamata Banerjee has faced from the governor of Bengal, this was a fight against a certain mindset. It was not against any individual, any caste, any community. And I joined the nation in congratulating Draupadi Murmuji. She has won the election. She's the president-elect. And we wish her well. And I hope she fights hard to protect the constitution. Yes, I'm going to...